today we're going to be looking at unboxing or unwrapping some leather. So this is Lamport in 1.5mm thickness from Metropolitan Leather. As we can see it's very well packaged, the ends have been protected with some extra tape. It has a layer of, sort of black waterproof plastic on it. Um, underneath that is some bubble wrap and then some brown paper and there's a tube inside. Let's have a nice listen to this. Want to make sure you take extra care when using a knife on this packaging. Although it's very well packaged, just try and cut at an angle which is either horizontal or pointing upwards away from the leather as you don't want to accidentally slice into your leather. As we are unrolling the leather, we're looking for inconsistencies, we're looking for a nice even finish, a nice even thickness throughout. We can see that this has been stamped on the underside with the size. This one is 13.6 square footage. I believe the average size for this on the website is 16. However, you do expect some variances in this. So we look for consistencies and any range markings. So there's a scar on this bit here. And what I'll do is check the underside as well to see how deep it is, if it's superficial or not. And here we can see where the scar runs across. So that is a deep scar. Depending on the project, you might want to cut around or avoid this. It's not really a big issue, big deal for what I make with this leather. It's normally small leather goods, so I can either cut around it or use it as a feature and have a nice prominent scar on the front of the work that I'm doing. When it comes to storing your leather, flat is ideal, but not many people have lots of room to store the leather flat. 
And so a loose roll, like what you've supplied with here, is the next best option. Links for Metropolitan Leather will be in the description down below. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you want to see more leatherworking tips, tricks and build-alongs, be sure to subscribe to the channel and hit that bell icon to be notified when new videos go live.